imagine for a minute that you are here this is your current state and that's your future that is where you want to achieve your goals in maybe three months time six months time 12 months time or in few years time so that's your desired future from your current state to your desired future you start your journey very focused determined and can you still guarantee me saying that no one I will have a smooth journey from where I am now to where I want to be there will be no unexpected events there will be no challenges at all unfortunately we can't have that assurance so one time there was this person who wants to get an assurance of what is going to happen to him in the future he wanted to have this uh, feeling of uh, certainty so he went to see this person uh, whom that he thought that uh, has this power and uh, most of all he knew that this person does not lie he always tell the truth so he went to see that person and he said uh, can you please look at my palm and tell me certainly what is going to happen to me in my future so that person looked at his palm and said sir i can certainly tell you your future is going to be very uncertain that's life right life is beautiful but life is uncertain life gives us opportunities life gives us challenges so that's life now the the actual question is when you are on your journey where you really want to achieve something that can change yourself that can make a huge impact into your family and to the whole world maybe so you really want to get there and you are on your way you are on your journey and something suddenly happens maybe something that you have no control of then what happens imagine that you are you are driving on a freeway and you suddenly miss your exit what happens you have to get yourself back on track isn't it now i have a question how long will it take for you to understand that you missed your exit that you made an uh, mistake that something has happened that has taken you out of your track for some people it takes hours days weeks for some it takes months and unfortunately for some people it takes years and years for them to realize that they are off the track and they have to come back to the track for them to continue achieving what they really want to achieve so today i'm going to talk to you about why it's important to make that turn make the u turn as soon as you can and put yourself back on track do you know the difference between successful people and others when these people are faced with a challenging situation uncertain event they quickly put themselves back on track by making a u turn as soon as they can and continue their journey that's how they get what they get that's how they go where they go so the question is what's the difference how they make the u turn sooner than these people so there are a few things we need to do first is you have to realize that you missed your exit you have to realize that you are off the track so understand your situation so research shows that uh, we have averagely 9000 to 60000 thoughts per day now the sad news is for some people 80% of those thoughts are negative thoughts that will make you feel guilty make you feel sad make you feel like giving up we talk to ourselves than we talk to anyone else it's called self talk so imagine that 80% of the time if we tell ourselves we are not good enough 
we are we cannot get there it's time for us to give up why it's happening to me if we keep talking to ourselves like that what is the chance that we'll have enough energy to make ourselves make that u turn and bring ourselves back on track sooner than others in my latest book u turn everyone deserves a second chance i talk about how can a person make this u turn and bring themselves back on track then i created a u turn platform public motivation program where i will go into details of how we can do that we get the audience to get involved with this process but in this video i will reveal some few tips for you to get yourself have this awareness and put yourself back on track if that's what you really want to now the first thing is understand that you made a mistake that you're off the track number 2 ask the right question so when i say right question there has to be a wrong question right unfortunately a lot of people in a situation like that if something happens unexpectedly they start asking three type of wrong questions they start with why me why cannot i get a break why it's always happening me so those are the wrong questions in my program i will tell you exactly what happens when you ask those questions but for this video i will just tell you the right question the right question is very simple it goes like this say you are in your journey and something happens unexpectedly stop worrying yourself and ask yourself what can i do about this what can i do about this what can i do about this situation ask this question not from anyone else ask from yourself you ask that question and wait your whole body will work on that give your brain something that it can work on it's a open question what can i do about this give me a solution it will definitely give you a solution and that solution will help you to put yourself back on track i will take a simple example right say you have this uh, very important day coming up so the day before you prepared yourself you you done everything that you can possibly do so you have done your part so you have to get up early so you made sure that you maybe put uh, two alarms in case one doesn't go off on time so you woke up in the morning you got yourself ready so you done your part so you got into your car or you are you went to the uh, station or you you found, call your cab and suddenly if it is in your car the car doesn't start or if you're planning to go on the train train service has been cancelled or your cab doesn't turn up now it's a bad situation right because you have to be in there on time for you to get what you were planning to get now how do you feel little anxious right now remember do not get into the uh, the type of questions that normal people would ask like why it's why it's happening to me why can't i get a break stop there instead ask yourself what can i do about this what can i do about this you ask the question and wait wait and wait then you will find a solution then you will realize oh i can do this i can do that or i can do this and that and that's your solution that will put you back on track and then you continue your journey simple right but it's not as simple as it looks like that's why people struggle that's why people give up that's why people feel sorry that's why people think that they can't take, get a break so at my u turn platform public program we will talk about this and we will tell you how to manage your self talk because that's the main thing that can make you feel happy or make you feel sad regardless of what's happening around your surroundings you still can feel happy 
you still can feel certain about your goals. You can still feel energized. It all depends on not what others say, but what your own self-talk tells you. So how do you recognize this? How do you manage this? We can talk about this in the next video. Thank you. Have a great day.